Hi everyone, Simon here with another update after the amazing response to the new layouts and drillings feature. Based on feedback and some things I didn't have time to get into the last release, version 2.6.2 is out now with lots of improvements to make it even better. On layouts, grips look more realistic, and most measurements from the selected drilling like spans and sizes are now shown on the ball. I fixed glitches when creating layouts with more extreme values and a handful of bugs that some of you contacted me about. If you want more info on balls that you use this layout with, tapping on one in the list now opens it right here rather than jumping out of the layout section into Arsenal, with a button down here when you want to go to the main screen to make changes. Over in drillings, rather than just a name, there's now more info in the list like handedness, thumb or no thumb and the PAP, and the same quick pop-up for viewing a ball. Back to a layout, and choosing a drilling, you'll see the new listing format is also used here. Lastly, in the bowling ball arsenal, when you view one of your balls that already have a drilling and layout added, the details are right on this screen, and again we can take a quick look by tapping on them, with the option to jump to the full version in the layouts or drillings areas. Likewise, when editing a ball, you now see more than just a name when choosing a drilling and layout. So, alongside a few performance and usability improvements behind the scenes, that's what's new in version 2.6.2. It's out now, and as usual, you should find your device updates automatically sometime over the next few days. Otherwise, just search on the App Store and look for the Update button. Please don't hesitate to contact me with questions or comments via the website at www.tenpintoolkit.com. You can also follow on Instagram, X and TikTok as Tenpin Toolkit, all one word, or search Tenpin Toolkit on Facebook. Thanks for watching, and bowl well.